first and foremost, well, of course, there's performance, um, and then exterior design, uh, uh, the level of completion of the refinement of the car, um, and then there's uh, the concept of the car, um, and the history and the background behind it. Of course, there's a lot of uh, advancements. The most, uh, most, most prominent would be uh, a lot of electronics. Uh, you see every year uh, new products are always coming out. Um, and, but it's, I think the other aspect would be uh, not so much an evolution like that, but uh, kind of a change in trend. Um, one year it would all be Japanese you know, tuning cars all over the place. Uh, and then the next year it would be all, all muscle cars. Uh, so there's a lot of, uh, you, know, you can see really the, uh, the changes in the trends uh, every year. Looking around at SEMA today, a lot of the popular cars seem to be uh, sort of a ret retrospective. Uh, there are a lot of uh, older cars that uh, that are on the stage. We've had uh, an aspect of that in Grand Prisma before. We've had you know, all sorts of muscle cars and old cars before, but uh, I think uh, it seems like at today's SEMA, uh, people are going back to the good old days um, to, and uh, going back to, like, you know, to the muscle cars. There's no real plans that we can discuss right now, but uh, production is moving forward. And uh, as for the update, we just did an update a couple weeks ago, so uh, there's nothing else that we can really say right now. I can only answer for that as well, but it, it is moving forward. It's, it's not, it hasn't been uh, knocked off of the plans, uh, it's there. In regards to like the uh, car interior and exterior, um, we've actually reached uh, a level, that, a target level that we had set for ourselves. Uh, we've actually uh, cleared that now. Um, so the next things that we would be working on would be the ambient surroundings around the car, um, whether it be the environment or the people surrounding the cars. Uh, and of course, uh, we've only done a very small part of what we want to do online. And of course, there's a lot of things you can do online uh, that we haven't even touched yet. Um, and, and a lot of that will actually, uh, will not only depend on the advancement of the hardware, but of the infrastructure, of, uh, the internet, and, uh, and, and the connection speeds and things like that as well. So uh, there's a lot of things as well. That A lot of the advancements you're talking about, this answer will kind of overlap with the previous uh, answer I just talked about, but the, we're really on the starting line for online features. Um, there, we're going to need a lot of software improvements, hardware improvements, and then uh, infrastructure improvements all around the world. And what we have to look at is uh, what are we going to do when the internet connections are 10,000 times faster than what it is now? What are we going to do uh, you know, to meet those type of advancements? That's the things that, you know, uh, that come across the mind uh, when you think of the future.